You can't get much closer to Mayberry than Hartzell, Alabama. But even in an all-American place like this, harsh reality is affecting tomorrow's Depot Days Festival. For the small city, it's a big deal for Hartzell. It's a great event. It brings everybody downtown. The 2017 Hartzell Depot Days Festival has been keeping Danielle Gibson busy. She's in charge of it all. Gibson's counting on nothing but fun Saturday. We have all kinds of events happening all day long, tractor show, car show, vendors, entertainment, all kinds of stuff. So there's something for everybody. We're going to put up uh, some school buses to block the street on Main Street. A reflection of the times, school buses will provide a buffer. That's a new security measure this year. The bus buffer intended to better protect people walking on the street and sidewalks. And that's what we've tried to do this year is just make that one little extra step. Instead of using just a normal barricade, the school has allowed us to use school buses to block Main Street off so that it is a little safer for the visitors that are coming to downtown for Depot Days. All this traffic routed away from Main Street between Corsby and Railroad Streets and police on foot will be on stepped up patrols throughout Depot Days. They want to be ready for whatever might come down the track. And we just try to be safe. Not that anyone will have an intent, but accidents can happen. We're just trying to prevent those accidents. Or if somebody does have an intent to commit a crime, then we want to try to stop that as well. Reassuring to Danielle Gibson, she wants another successful Depot Days Festival for Hartzell. Lots of people to protect. About 19,000 people turned out last year. Everything gets started tomorrow morning at 8. The festival wraps up at 4. Reporting in Hartzell, Greg Privet, Way 31 News.